Hello friends, I am Asam Sudhatel and welcome to Info Crown. Today we are going to see the fundamentals of the chess game. Let us travel further on roads of knowledge in this channel. Okay, let's start. The chessboard has two colored pieces, namely white and black, having 18 pieces on each side of the board. It contains eight pawns, two rooks, two knights, two bishops, and a queen on the matching colors that is white queen on the light square and the black queen on the dark square and a king on its remaining place. The chess pieces are arranged in a way that all pieces face their counter pieces on the opposite side. The king is the most important chess piece. Even though it is the most important chess piece, we cannot say that it is the strongest piece. The king can move in all directions but only one step ahead. In this example, the king can go to this, the eight possible ways. Here, 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 here and here. When the king is attacked by another piece, it's called a check. In this example, the queen is attacking the black king and he has no way to defend it. So he has to move his king to another safe square. In this example, he can move in these three squares or these three squares. When the king is in check and does not have any squares to move, it's called a checkmate. After the checkmate, the opponent wins the game. The queen is the most important piece on board. It can move in all directions. Unlike the king, it can move as many squares as it wants. In this example, the queen covers these rows and these horizontal vertical lines and can diagonally move on these squares. Next to the queen, the most important piece on the board is the rook. The rook can move horizontally and vertically. In this, rook can move on these vertical rows and these horizontal columns. The bishops are the pieces in the chessboard which can move diagonally. There are two bishops, the black one and the white one. No matter how we move the bishops, they never come in each other's line. Together, they make a good team. The knights are some funky pieces on the chessboard. They move in a way that two moves in the front and one move on side. It is the one and only piece that can jump over another piece. Pawns are one of the simplest pieces on the board. Each player has eight pawns. Pawns take other pieces in a diagonal one step ahead of them. In this example, the pawn takes the knight like this. When the pawns reach on the other side of the board, it becomes a, a queen, a rook, a bishop or a knight which makes them more powerful.